For the first time in 45 years, the Bearcats are conference champs. Cincinnati defeats UConn 22-5 here this afternoon at Specter Field here with head coach Scott Guggins. What a ride this has been this week. What an exclamation point for your team today. It really was, and, and again, I couldn't be happier for the seniors, you know. They, they did a great job. David Orndorff started, played really well, or pitched really well. You know, A.J. Bump is out in right field, Cole Murphy at, at first base, you know, Mason Deanna coming in and, and doing a great job catching, got a couple of hits. Our guys were, were locked in, and it's, it's, it was fun to be a part of. I didn't think, it, you know, Connecticut's a very good team. I didn't think the game was going to get out of hand like it did. I'll be honest with you, I'm glad it did because, it, you know, it was, it was, it was a tight game uh, early on, and, and uh, our guys responded well and uh, just couldn't be happier for them right now. Certainly uh, a lot to be happy about, not only with today, but, but the way this whole season has gone along. You look at the journey of this team, starting 1-9, and nine, nobody, uh, you know, beat themselves up, nobody gave up. Uh, you guys just kept working, kept getting better. We did, and I, you know, I said to JD, I said, "Man, have we won four games in a row this this entire season?" I'm not sure if we did or not, but you know, our coaching staff did a great job. You know, JD Heilman and uh, with the pitchers, and you know, Kyle Sprague with the hitters, Tony McConnie with the catchers and the hitters, and you know, Andy Nagel. I mean, we got a great staff. You know, I you know, I give a lot of credit to the seniors, but you know, I, I can't do it without those those uh, the support staff too. And again, they're all on board and, and pulling the same direction. It was it was awesome to be a part of that dugout. Was fun. There were some some anecdotes maybe I didn't like in there but you know I, I just I, I didn't want to squelch the, the the energy you know I wanted to wanted to enjoy being out here being in a championship atmosphere and and uh, they responded to it there has been so much energy around the team this week and it has been fun to follow you know back at the beginning of the season when we were doing our preseason interviews with, with you with with all the players you know we said what are your goals for the year everybody without missing a beat said conference championship we want a conference championship that's what we're out to do this year whatever else happens we'll, we'll get there when we get there but this was such a big goal for this team what does that mean to be able to accomplish it well you know I didn't know we didn't have never won a game in the conference <laughs> tournament to, to, to before this year so uh, it, it means a lot you know when you're when you're trying to, to build on the on the, tra tra the tradition here at UC and build upon what's what's already here you you need to have those successes and you got to have some of that stuff where you're like man not only you're gonna play in a great conference and a great you know facility but man those guys win they win championships because you know recruits they want to win championships alumni they they want to they want to be a part of championships our players they want to be a part of championships and and it's it's huge it, it goes and and you just don't know where the momentum can take the program or this team uh, you know when, when you win like that well there's no question there's a whole lot of momentum in this program right now and let's hope it carries over to the NCAA regionals next week coach congratulations you are champions and uh, we'll see you on the selection show where you guys are headed let's hope we get back in time for the selection right. <laughs> show I'm not sure we're gonna get back in time Matt but we'll, we'll, be, we'll be there man thanks as long as the bus doesn't break down right break down we still have to make some good time that was a long game nope. <laughs> that was. These four and a half hour games in the heat, uh, they can do a number on you, but you guys uh, outlasted it. Congratulations. We'll see you back in Cincinnati. Yeah, but when you win, it's, it's worth it. It absolutely is. Head coach Scott Guggins after the Bearcats win at the American Athletic Conference Championship with a 22-5 victory over UConn. Here with the 2019 American Athletic Conference Tournament, most outstanding player, A.J. Bumpus. Uh, you know, we were talking uh, with some folks around the stadium before the game today saying, hey, no matter what happens today, I think Bump has to be the MOP. And uh, you put the exclamation point on it, though, today with a home run, unbelievable offensive performance all week. Just uh, what, what has this week been like for you? Uh, it's been a grind, but it's been very, I mean, it's been very rewarding. Um, just the hard work I know this team put in um, and seeing it come out on the field, it's been very rewarding. I'm glad to see it. It certainly kind of it is, as we said, the exclamation point on the season. Uh, you know, kind of just looking back at the big picture, you know, you're a senior, you're four years here, you've seen this program rise a little bit each year. Uh, what does it mean to be able to accomplish this here at the end of your Bearcats career? I mean, it means a lot. I mean, leave my legacy, um, leave the seniors' legacy, um, kind of get this program over the hump. Um, doing something that we have never done before, so it means a lot. And I know you guys all have been talking this season. You know, when we asked you before the year, you know, what are your goals? What are your goals? Everybody said conference championship. Conference championship. We'll, we'll see what happens after that, but we think we can win a conference championship, and we're out to do it, and you guys did do it. Yeah, I think this year, we've all, I mean, years prior, um, we've always said it, but I don't really think we really believed it. Um, and this year, I think we actually believed it. We started talking about it more. Um, and we all pulled the same direction. Um, and it's amazing to see it actually come true. So, yeah. It was a, a dream come true for this team this year. Well, now that the championship ceremony is uh, wrapped up, now we can look ahead. 
NCAA Tournament Regionals next week. How does that feel to be a part of that? Uh, it feels amazing. Uh, I love, I love uh, hostile environments, honestly, so I'm looking forward to it. Um, I hope it will be wherever we play. There's a great crowd, great atmosphere. Can't wait. Can't wait for it either. Bump, congratulations. Awesome performance this week. We'll see you at the regionals. Appreciate it. Thank you. Here with Jace Mercer after the Bearcats Championship at the American Athletic Conference Tournament. Uh, six plate appearances today. You reached base every single time, but none bigger than that big grand slam. Take us through it. Yeah, I was really just trying to get a good pitch to hit. Um, we were up by a lot, but we really wanted to put them away early. We know it's a good team, and they have a lot of real good pitching staff over there, so credit to them. But really was our big thing was to keep the lead moving forward and forward and keep playing as the game went on, and that's what we did today. You guys certainly did. Uh, you weren't satisfied with that lead. You kept uh, just wanted to attack every at-bat, and that seems like it's been kind of the attitude all week. Don't worry about the implications. Just take it pitch by pitch, at-bat by at-bat. Yeah, I mean, big thing in baseball, the game's never really over. It's not really over to the last outs made, so you got to keep playing, keep fighting, keep scrapping through at-bats, get quality at-bats, uh, get runs in, just play the game hard, and just see what happens when that final out's made. Well, we saw what happened, and now this team uh, has the trophy. You guys will be headed to the NCAA Regionals next week, but looking at just the journey of the team this year, you guys picked to finish last in the league. Uh, you know, a lot of doubters out there. You guys just kept coming back. You kept uh, earning win after win, but what does it mean to be uh, standing here uh, on the championship of presentation today? It's a crazy feeling. I mean, we really we worked our butts off all year. Uh, we had a lot of ups and downs. It's been a roller coaster season, but the biggest thing is we still stuck together. We're a family. It's a big brotherhood that you're not gonna lose forever, and we we won. We're champs. <laughs> I, I really can't explain how good I feel right now, but you know we have a regional next week, but we're gonna enjoy this one real well. Oh, you should enjoy. It. Congratulations, unbelievable performance this week, and uh, we look forward to that regional. Thank you. All right, Jace Mercer reaches base all six times in the Bearcats championship here today against UConn, including a Grand Slam.